you know, I, I was just talking with Paul Rudd and, 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 and Peyton Reed, these people who jumped onto this little thing called Ant-Man many, many years ago and believed us when we said, but we really believe this character, if he connects, can be the key and the linchpin to the bigger universe. And now here we stand at the premiere of Quantumania, which is the kickoff of phase five. And as people already saw in Endgame, where he helped save the whole world, which Scott Lang will remind you of if you were ever talk, to talk to him. It's really fun because this movie is not just, uh, you know, another, another story. It is a continuation of this family. You know, much more so than any other movie. Scott Lang and Hope and Cassie and seeing this father and daughter and multiple father and daughters. It's very funny. It's very sweet. It's very relatable. And then we throw them all down to the quantum realm and introduce Kang, which for us is something we've waited many, many years to do. We saw a little glimpse of a version of him in uh, the season finale of Loki on Disney+, Plus, but Jonathan Majors makes a gigantic and colossal impression into the MCU with Quantumania, and I can't wait for people to see it. You know, I, this is, of, of all of our films we've done since Endgame, this is the one that connects to the bigger picture, and that's what I'm excited about. Phase four, we introduced a lot of fun, great characters on Disney+, Plus and in theaters, and all of whom will be very important going forward. But now finally kicking off phase five, people are gonna to start to see the bigger picture as we get towards the next Avengers film. So that, I'm very excited for that part.